Hello you cracky humans. Welcome to New York City on a cold snowy night, riding home. You're watching the Cycling Maven vlog. You. Hannah and I are just going down for some breakfast. We're going to hang out. It's a cracking day, 29 degrees. I actually don't know where we're going. We'll just keep riding. But uh, yeah, we're just going to go chill out, have some brekkie and uh, hang out and just soak up the sun. It's perfect weather. All right, so I'm on the Giant CX bike at the moment. The Canyon is getting the DI2 Shimano repair, which we don't know what's wrong with it yet. I had a phone call from Sean. He said he doesn't know yet, so he's still trying to work that out. And, uh, the obviously the Bianchi is broken. I've actually set the Bianchi up on the trainer at home, but uh, it's it's leaning to one side because the rear stays broken. It's really unstable, even on the trainer. So I can't even set it up as an expensive trainer setup. So I've got a spare Fondrius frame there, and I'm probably going to transfer all the gear over onto the Fondrius frame. I and girls, guys and girls, I am. I've been tasked put to put. Right, so we've cleaned this area up because it was an absolute shit fight, right? We never actually used this area. So Hannah has tasked me with mounting a, what is it, a planter box? Yeah, it's a vertical a garden. So a vertical garden on that brick wall. Now you guys know I'm no handyman, but I'm going to show you that I, I actually am. I'm actually pretty good. I've got a masonry drill and a masonry drill bit and watch this. You want it that high? Yeah, because it's herbs, so I've got to cut them. Okay, so let me mark it out. This is the thigh. This is the thumbnail. Girl. Who is the man? Me. Good watering. Solid watering, Anna. What do you Alright, you're gonna put all this shit away? How cute does it look? You're gonna put all this shit away? Nah. Yeah. Sure job. Hey. Out there. Yeah. Alright legends, with our new background setting here with the plants, I thought I'd, I'd do this unboxing out here. Bit of a uh, traditional old school unboxing. Uh, that's a bit of a giveaway as to what it is. All right, that wasn't much. Oh, I've been getting a lot of DJI stuff lately. Don't know what that is. Oh, ho, ho. It's a bit of fly more combo. This is courtesy of my friends at Model Flight, uh, RC, they're a South Australian group. Uh, they have sent me my new Mavic Pro. So uh, this is a lot more mobile. I've got a Phantom 4 as you know, so I'll probably send that back to them and they'll sell it. Anyone looking for a Phantom? But um, they've sent me this and uh, I will be able to carry this around on the bike with me, get some drone shots while I'm out riding. And uh, it's a lot more lighter and mobile and just easier and probably better for cyclists in general. So I'm really si excited about that. I don't know what this thing is. This is the Fly More Combo. What is that? There's a spare battery. Yeah, so there's a battery there, battery hub, charger, some spare propellers. So, I'm a very lucky man. Thank you guys, really appreciate that. You would not believe that that thing is straight. It's actually straight. So it's pretty crazy that it is the size of my hand, really. This thing. Proudly supported by these legends. And uh, they also sent me this, this backpack, which is uh, like, that's pretty sick. That is pretty amazing, so 
How good's that, Henny? So good. Awesome? Yeah. It's the, it's the late afternoon here in Melbourne, quite late, it's about 20 past six, but Sean from the Bike Tailor, mate, that guy works far too hard, uh, which is pretty standard when you open up a new business. But he's a very, very hard worker and he's been frantically trying to get my DI2 fixed on the canyon. They've had a lot of dramas, even the Shimano rep Miguel came in and he spent many hours working on the bike and they just, there was all sorts of software issues with the bike. Sorry, with the, uh, the DI2, there was, uh, you know, software incompatibilities and all sorts of things and it's a bit of a long story but Miguel, let me, let me say I will give a massive hat tip to Shimano because they have put a Miguel has put a lot of time and effort into get, trying to get this DI2 fixed for me, and to the point where he couldn't get the left hand lever fixed, so he went home, got the lever off his bike, and gave it to me while his while the broken one goes back to um, back to uh, the Shimano people. So massive kudos to Shimano in Australia. Thank you so much for your help. So is it fixed? We're good to go. Mate, yeah. has it hasn't been a massive head. <laughs> it's been okay. It's been okay. <laughs> that, that, my friends, was the political answer. The po positive political answer. This one, yeah. All right, these will be my case for today. Good. All right, boys, thanks again. You Love go. your work. Pleasure. Legends. On a night like tonight, it is going to be an absolute hive of activity down here at St Kilda. It, um, it's going to be heaving. Mainly because of the weather's so nice tonight, there's very little wind and uh, there's just going to be humans everywhere. So this is pretty much the hub of St Kilda, St Kilda Beach. On hot days, people just get steaming down here, beers everywhere. But it's a really cool place to hang out. If you, um, it's probably one of the best beaches to hang out in Melbourne. And there's a lot of backpacks and stuff, a lot of travellers down here just chilling out. So, love this place, especially on a nice hot day. And there's a couple of good bars up there where you can go have a drink and uh, have a couple of beers sitting out on the on the foreshore. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> How short is that dress, Hannah? Babe, I can't ride it. No. Babe, I can't even reach the pedal. Can't you? 